Hello geocachers, it's Symbol here and we've come to a nice cache here and I wanted to show you this. Um, uh, sometimes it's really good to actually not just read the hint which actually says uh, magnetic and as you can see we've come to um, uh, a waypost here where, where it looks like the, um, I thought it was going to be on this post here but it's magnetic lost so I just want to show you it's lost its um, uh, signs with the arrows and things never mind it's magnetic so it won't be the wood but um, there's a gate here and that's mag that's magnetic and it's actually a microtube so I've got this um, my little specialist geo tool little tweezers it's a really strong pair and now, if you don't read some, uh, the comments or the feedback, you can get really confused. Because actually, I just came up here and magnetic, and it's beat round here. There's no more magnetic things around here. Look, it could be hidden under the stones, I suppose. But open space. I've just come from up there. Just wanted to show, show you this part of the world. This is in. Uh, Worcestershire, England, UK. So it's a beautiful area. So there's nothing else around here except that post, these stones, and that. Um, well, that's um, metal, so it's it could be magnetic. But if you read the comments, one of the comments was, "You knew, you nearly. I nearly fell for it. That was it. I nearly fell for it." So I came up here and said, ah, I did start looking at the, the metal and that, that, that comment um, rung, a, rung a bell in my mind. I thought, oh, am I getting tricks here? Thinking it's going to be on the me me metallic and I looked at it for a micro stuck on one of the parts of the metal fence. So I thought, no, let's just look around other parts of this area. And, can you spot anything? See the distance from the metal? So you could have spent half an hour <laughs> looking there or given up, did not find DNFs. Or, sometimes, it's good to look around or read the comments. So, what's this? Lovely camo. It's still a magnetic, in a lovely magnetic um, case. There's the magnet. So that was a good trick, nearly tricked. And I've got, I love these little tubes because that could get wet, get water inside these. So a lot of people know I do this on my geocaches as well. So a little tube there with the logs in there, nice and dry. And you need the tweezers to actually see the little tweezers sticking out there. I'm going to use these tweezers to get that uh, geocache out. But what do you think of that? I think I'm going to have to give a favourite for that for the the cleverness. And it's really strong. It's one of those. I don't know what they call. Them. I'm going to have to find them. I think you can find them on eBay and all kinds. See that magnet? Really extra strong uh, magnet. And he screwed it there and there and that's really strong that actually that's really strong look and he's done his camo tape as well which I do on some of mine so that's one I'm going to um, I'm going to steal that idea and uh, put it on one of my geocaches so what do you think of that everyone remember read the comments hope you enjoyed that happy geocaching this is Symbol. Bye for now.